It's looking all over for you. Thought you might have tried to postpone. Can't just postpone a job interview. Yeah, I know. But they could make an exception, you know, because of what happened today. Oh, you mean because I screwed up so completely that someone's dead? Oh, yeah, sure. Let me just call up the hiring committee and fill them in, Levi. So you think you're in the best condition to interview for your dream job? Just email them, okay? Then we can get out of here. No, you don't get it, because you let failure hold you back your whole life. It's basically your entire identity. But it's not mine. So much of the world operates without us ever thinking about it. Dr. Kim, it's nice to see you. Your application is tremendously impressive. Hey, Dr. Hogan's, thank you for making the time to talk to me. I've wanted to be a part of your program since I, since I first uh, chose ortho as my specialty. We expect it to work out in our favor. And most of the time it does. Let's just go home, order in. I have to go to my place and get some clean clothes. I'm so tired, I might just crash there. Move in with me. What? I love you, Maggie. I don't want to take it for granted. I don't want to miss it. Yeah, move in with me. We worry about the future and think about the past. miss what's right in front of us. You were drinking at work? Joe, I'm done. You hear me? I'm done. I need you to hear me. I need you to talk to me. I love you, Joe. I love you, but if I... If you love me, you will let me... No, 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 no. We're not playing that game anymore. We're not playing that if you love me, you'd leave me alone. You went to Pittsburgh and we were good. Stop. We were good, and then you come back, and you won't talk to me, and you're drinking at work. Yes, please. So how about I just go to Pittsburgh and find out what the hell happened to my wife? Huh? We take what's good and easy and working for granted. I will talk to you when I'm ready to talk to you. And if you ever threaten to go to Pittsburgh again, I will leave you. Are we clear? If you ever come to work drunk again, I'll tell Bailey. Great. We have a deal. Until it's no longer good and easy and working for us. It's normal. But we can do better. Because there are tiny, beautiful gifts we're given every day. So, the reason why... You saw Dr. DeLuca here the other night. Was because he and I have been spending more time together. Is he your boyfriend? He is. What's that mean? Well, that means that I like him a lot. Not more than you, but a lot. Are you going to kiss him? Probably. Ew, gross. Oh, gross. Is he going to sleep on the couch again? <laughs> no. He won't be sleeping on the couch, but he may be coming around a lot more, so. But I'm not going anywhere. You're stuck with me. Can you leave his guitar at home? <laughs> and it's up to us to appreciate them to the fullest while we can. <laughs>